Hi everyone, this is Kim. I'm outside the chimpanzee habitat at the San Francisco Zoo where my chimpanzee friends live. And I thought I'd do my intro to my plea for the wildlife way station chimps here because it was through my love for my chimpanzee friends um, that I was involved in a documentary and about our male cobby. And through doing research for that, I found a chimpanzee that I watched on TV and grew up with living at Wildlife Way Station. So like our Kabi, who's lived here since 1968 and was previously an entertainment chimp, a chimpanzee at Wildlife Way Station named Charlie, Charlie Chuckles, um, grew up in entertainment as well. Uh, playing the lead in a 70s TV series called Lancelot Link. As a child, Lancelot Link was one of my favorite TV shows, even though now I know that using chimps in entertainment or any other primate is not a good thing at all. Um, so Charlie and Cobby both were lucky after their turn in entertainment their owners released them to sanctuary. Um, Kabi came to the San Francisco Zoo at 10 years old in 1968 and Charlie went to the Wildlife Way Station Sanctuary where he still resides and is one of the chimps in need there of a new home. There's 32 chimps there. A lot of them were from laboratory research some of the other ones were from entertainment as well. There's Cobbs. There's Cobby. There's Kadir hanging out in the sun. So a lot of the chimpanzees that are waiting for new homes at the Wildlife Way Station, they deserve to live the rest of their life in a secure environment, which the Wildlife Way Station was going to be, but it suddenly closed last year and a few of the chimps have been rehomed, but 32 others are waiting. They're the only ones left at the sanctuary. Uh, this is a fairly new yard that was built for our chimps and it costs money to make yards and provide good homes for them and be able to commit to taking care of them for the rest of their lives, which could be a long time. Our copy is 62 years old. So if they have chimpanzees there that are in their teens or 20s, that's a 40 year commitment. And uh, like I said, it takes some money. These chimpanzees all need homes. There's a few sanctuaries who are willing to provide them with homes, but they need money to build enclosures to be able to have that security to take care of them, feed them, provide them health care, keeper care. So I'll um, put the link in to where you can read more about it. But if you have any extra funds, a few extra dollars, I know these are tough times for everybody, but um, maybe you can just give a little bit to help those 32 chimps that are waiting to find a forever home. Thank you.